Hello everyone and welcome back to the Gaming by Geeks channel. My name is Adam and I am back with episode 14 of my Open TTD first series. Today, continuation from last week really, just a little bit more of the tidying up um, of the buyout of the uh, previous company that I bought out because I have been looking a little around. I've been looking around. <laughs> And I have found, yeah, some, some more oddities that need to sort out. Um, one of them I found was here. We've got this scrap metal place, which is quite small, but seems to be generating a lot of scrap metal. Uh, and of course we've got the AI's bizarre snake of, uh, of a journey that it takes. So I just want to do a little bit of upgrading here to to sort him out a little bit. So I'm going to keep some of it the same, um, but I'm going to change. I'm going to have more dual track as pretty much as much as I can, really. And uh, yeah, I have the trains a bit bigger. So let's just dive straight into that. I want to make these five long. Go. That's that end done. I want to try and make double track on here as best as I can because there's no need not for it to be a double track. We've got the money, we've got the space largely, not entirely, of course. Um, let's move these bits let's remove that remove that and we'll remove that we'll remove that and that just want to make sure that's definitely electrified a railway it is then I've got some auto renews failing, that's no surprise. Right, he should stop at these lights. He has. Good. I was a little bit worried then, I thought he was going to blast through them, but he hasn't. Good boy. <laughs> I'm starting to get a little bit worried there. Uh, right, let's sort out this mess here. What, what have we got going on here? He goes off, he goes over there. This is all largely unnecessary, isn't it? So I'm going to come this way. When I destroy that station, I'm going to change its orientation a bit. So that it goes this way instead. So let's get the ground leveled up there a bit. Let's pull down the land here. There we go. Turning in, turning in, and up the hill to where the new station will be. Now, all I've got to do is get these two buggers onto that line. And the only way I'm going to do that is with some form of crossover point here. And then I've got to basically wait for this one to go. You know, he's, he's, he's not gone in tough, he's missed his slot now. Damn you, new 
College. Very poor. Understandable. Have a bunch of trees. There you go, poor. There. Now that's back down. These guys will struggle. And it will be confusing. But it will get there. So I'm just going to wait for this one. Let's start removing the remnants of the old line. You see behind this train. Hey, look, one's already on there. do is do the old crisscross thingamajigger here and they should be good to go now that that is done these trains are happy I have put down some depots two at the end here one over down the other end. Now I need to get these trains in and I need to get them expanded, extended, whichever the right word for that is. So let's get some more, I think, yeah, it looks like coal trucks, isn't it? Yep, scrap metal is coal trucks. Just to make sure I'm not going mad. Yes, so if I add on new ones for some reason it doesn't automatically refit them to the others so I have to do a quick manual refit there and I'll do the same with this chap so that's one two three four refit scrap metal go so now both of these trains will be able to take a decent amount more not a lot it's what, 120 tons more? You know what, it's actually effectively doubled. So I think that's going to going to help bring that down a little bit, but not necessarily an enormous amount. And here comes the other one who must have stopped something. I thought he left at the same time. Maybe not. So we'll see also if the ratings go up here, which is entirely possible. Got some also renewing failing going on here. So let's sort him out. I'm guessing he's a, oh, he's a Darwin 300. I thought the Darwin 300 stayed to the end. I guess not. Must be, must be just the 400 that stays to the end. Uh, I also saw some other tr uh, vehicles, oh, I was about to say trains, but it may not have been, that was complaining about auto renew not working. It's going to be on this guy, isn't it? These guys are just taking their time. Yeah, he's probably the last diesel on that line still. Any others that want to renew as well? You, you want to renew apparently, and what the hell are you? Oh, he, I thought he was sticking out the uh, out of the back because he had too many. Uh, it was not the case, it was just, he just broke down before he got there. So, let's see any others. Train 71, you are in the depot, you are coming out of the depot, that's fine. Yeah, they're all good, okay. So let's sort this chap out. Get rid of him, 
you can go up to the SH-40, which is the only train available now. So all the diesels have gone. Excellent, that's that done. Does that mean I haven't got Maglev yet? I can't remember when Maglev comes around. Uh, I imagine it's not too far away. Uh, right, do I have any other weird things that this guy has done? So let's have a look. So that's the one I've just upgraded. It's slowly coming down. It was up in the five thousands, now it's down in the threes, so that's good. That's progress. Uh, Standing Bar Castle. Oh wow. Standing Castle Bar Grill Rooms. This has grown a bit since we last saw it, hasn't it? Wow. Uh, sorry, I've got some aircraft that are seemingly dying here. So yeah, so that's... Oh, that's a male. It's a male that's got the issue. Not quite what I was expecting. I thought it'd be a little bit of both. So maybe I need to get myself another male train out here somewhere. Get them that looked into. Uh, it's just more for the ones I don't recognise. Tilly Brook Marsh Airport. Got planes dying everywhere, really. These, they're just, oh, they're just broken down. That's all. They're not old. Uh, Dronus South. He goes. <sighs> look at it. Just look at it. I mean. That's something I can deal with. I did say I was probably going to do some of this off camera, but I wasn't too sure, so maybe I won't. So he needs sorting. Let's see if I can't give him some, some more dual track and uh, make it end just a little bit nicer. I'm going to have to make some adjustments here on site because that's obviously going to be wrong. So that's going to have to be more like that. Uh, this one here is going to have to be just pulled back a couple. And then I'll obviously adjust those when it's time. In the meantime, let's sort these planes out that are in here that need to sort out. Right, off you go. Twenty six can be swapped over as well. He can go as well. Right, let's sort this thing out this horrific mess. So that needs to go up to there. That road's going to be in the way and I suspect we're not going to be in the good books up there. So deleting stuff like this is not going to be allowed. So I will have to come around could landscape that there. So now all I've got to do is somehow get two tracks over here like this. It shouldn't be too difficult at all, to be honest. Uh, let's see, I need to do this to here. That. That's dual line now. That can come all the way down to here. That can join there. This can come up, join to there. 
Now remove all of this, all of this stuff. Uh, let's just make a little adjustment there. Make an adjustment here. There we go. Now he's going to come to a small bit of single track here, which is understandable, but then he can obviously get back into the station. So it's not too far. You shouldn't have too long to wait. I could somehow get some dual track in there, maybe. But uh, I think we'll just leave that as it is for the moment. So that's 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 an improvement. That's good at least it but it looks a bit nicer, doesn't it? <laughs> and it's gonna improve efficiency. So these trains won't have to mess about stopping all the time and taking it a longer route, they'll take a much shorter route. And they'll only be waiting for each other at one end. Now in terms of the volume of scrap metal, I can probably expand this one. Oh, train's coming. But I don't know if I'll be able to expand this one. Let's see, I'll, I'll probably have more luck adding on to it. Yes, I can add on to it, no problem. That's probably the better way to do it. So next up is same as the previous one. Let's get some more cars on there. So let's get them both into the uh, into the depots. Looks like this one here is going to win. And where's the coal truck? There it is. Or refit for scrap metal, send him out on his way. This guy is at the opposite ends. One, two, three, four, refit for scrap metal, off you go. Now in the meantime, you've got a plane here that cannot be replaced. Seemingly. So what, what is he? He's one of the fruit planes. There'll be, a, there'll be more of them coming shortly. Uh, let's see. Sort by... No, don't, let's not worry about that. I want uh, size. Is there a size thing on here? I thought there was. Maybe not. Yeah, look, all these planes are starting to get old. Uh, so what do we have that is small? It's got, there's got to be one on here that's defined as a small airplane, otherwise none of my air, smaller airports are going to work. Uh, yes, he's a small airplane. And the Dinger is a smaller airplane, which appears to be a little bit bigger. bit more reliable so let's go with him he's still got but he, he does need to be refitted though so fruit off you go are you and similarly what's this guy he's just a regular passenger plane right yeah Possible stuff popped up whilst I was busy there, so if I missed it, it will just it will flag up again. Mind you, I can always have a scroll through here, can't I? Let's see if we've got any reds. Got any reds? Nope, they're all good. The boats are good, making a surprising amount of money. 
I'd be surprised if there's some cars. Oh no, we've got a bus there. There must be a, a bus that's gone out of service. Oh look, we've got a bunch of vehicles here, so let's, let's sort these all out. Yeah, that was quite an old one. Not as much. So, let's send these whatever these are. What, are. what are these? Livestock. So I'm guessing these are all going to be UHL ones now. What's that one? One. one. Oh, look at that. Just, just replaced the bus and now I get a new one. You go away, replace you with a livestock van, send you on your way, you go away, livestock van, send you on your way. Let's close some of these windows because I have so many open, it's taking up all the space. You, oh, I missed one. Hey, you, turn around. Head to this one. I missed two actually, look. <laughs> one, two. Right. Go away, go away, go away. Right, any, any more for any more? No. We got some vehicles. I'm not going to go about messing about with these vehicles there. They're just such small amounts. That literally must have just twiggered. Twiggered? Triggered. Oh, there's a lot going on. Let's have a look at the, uh, the new bus. So he is... 35 passengers and goes 55 miles an hour. The new good one is 37 passengers and goes 70 miles an hour, so it's faster and takes more people. The super bus is super unreliable. Does almost 80 miles an hour and takes 40 passengers. I'll, I'll stick with the normal foster bus until that one has improved its efficiency. Seriously, with these vehicles, I'll be doing this all day. That's not going to be fun to watch. It's already boring enough. Right. What what was next on here? Has this started to go down far enough yet? It's holding around the three mark, isn't it? Quabara Boneyard is just always going to be there. I think it's just one of those things. Uh, otherwise, everything's just going to be about right. Tillywell is going to have a billion passengers, but... But it has buses, so you can never fix them. And we've got another one of these weird ones where I've got two stations here. So we've got a fruit one from that farm, I'm guessing. And that zigzags down under... Oh, it looks like I've already given this one some subtle improvements. And there's not much I can really do about that because of this bridge here, which I can't change because these guys hate me. Let's see, let's follow you back. So it's you and you, isn't it? This one supposedly is not the problem. It's this one. With the 2,000 passengers. Such a tiny little train station. I'm not surprised that there's uh, so many trains, uh, people there, passengers, but no one is actually getting anywhere because the train's going to be absolutely freaking tiny. Oh, God. I'm going to do all these old vehicles off camera. There's just too many. Never ending. 
So let's see, are these these people should be happy enough that I can expand the station here with relative ease. Let's get things ready. Should we go to a five? Boom, boom. Put the depot back. And in here, again, shouldn't be much of a problem. We'll, we'll just have one depot on this line, I guess. And I'm going to send this train to it right now. He's also going to get an upgrade. His reliability is a little low. So, firstly... I know it's slower. But it's more reliable, probably a little cheaper to run, literally by, what's that, about 80 quid a year, and uh, it can just take more passengers, because I can get an extra car on. Boom. Go out there and be the best freaking awesome, hugely long train you can be. These damn, these damn cars are going to be the bane of me. Going to ruin this episode. Vehicles. So let's see if that starts to go down a bit now. This end is not quite so bad. Oh, what are you? Are you a bus? No, you're just a normal bus. That's fine. Oh, that's that's two, two of them done. Oh god, now now there's planes. Is this a fruit plane? Yeah. Okay, I thought as much. I did say these were going to be coming in a minute. Ah, Breedstone Central Sixty. That's you, isn't it? Yeah, get to a depot, mate. Well, yeah, you're going to be soon if you're not already, so. But the one that he's complaining about is you. Okay, that, that, that's enough. I'm going to lose track of all of these, all these vehicles now if I'm not careful. Right, one, go, done. Broken down, broken down. You are stopped. Is there is there a depot there? There's a depot, I just cannot see it behind this lot. So let's replace you. Replace you. Right, that's it. You done, you done, you done. I don't know. Got another diesel. I thought they were all they were all done, the diesels. Obviously not. That was a nice easy one. You are replaced by a dinger, aren't you? A dinger 100. Make sure he's refitted for fruit. 24 tonnes of fruit. That just seems low, but is what it is. Right, any more vehicles? Oh look, there's a freaking hundred of them. That's no surprise, there's always road vehicle crashes. Right. Yeah, this is a mail truck, so replace him. Here's my mail truck. Not right at the top there. Off you go, replace you with a mail truck, off you go. Ooh! So the new super bus is officially available. Got 
him. Right, you, you're old. You, you are old as well. Is it whale? Yes. Uh, right, what are you? You are China clay. So make sure that ends up refitted to China clay. You are livestock. You can have a new livestock UHL van. Off you go. Whatever these stupid notices here. Right, you are in the depot. That's not the depot, that's the other thing. And you are, oh, that's right, you were trying to clay as well, weren't you? So let's put you in there. We fit you to try to clay. Off you go. He, that was just perfect timing that he happened to be there. Uh, is he, he's a passenger's and male. I'd like to get my aircraft sorted because they uh, they tend to fall out of the sky a little bit easier if you uh, if you don't look after them. So make sure they don't get too old and just well kill people. Now you are a fruit one as well. Right back to road vehicles. You, you, and you. Let's just do a few at a time, otherwise we end up getting very confused. And we'll speed up time. You are just a normal passenger bus, that's fine. Off you go. Done. You, what, what, are, what are you? You're an alcohol truck. So you are one of those, refitted to alcohol, off you go. You were trying to clay, right? Yes. Right, that's another batch done. Next, you, which are iron ore, interestingly, I haven't seen any of them yet. It's another iron ore one. Ah, oh, look. Oh, there's loads. All right, you know what? I'll do it off camera. It's going to bore the hell out of you otherwise, and it's already been boring of an episode, as it is. Oh, I've got to do things, more interesting things, than just constantly dicking around with all this lot. Thirty-two is iron ore. Thirty-five. Why are you here? You're brand new. Why are you there? I probably misclicked on that one. All these four billion messages. Yeah, 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 they're old. I'll deal with them in a minute. Right. In that case, it is end of the... Well, the world's most boring episode. I'm really sorry. That was a terrible episode. I promise I will do something more interesting next week. Um, who knows what? Maybe I'll do something with this thing because that's a lot of people. i get some new stations in and something cool around here. So... Thank you very much for watching. As usual, if you like, hit the like, hit the subscribe, get the bell on so you get the notifications, share on whatever, the more people that watch this the better. And yeah, just a, a huge thank you for, for joining me and putting up with this dreadful episode. <laughs> and I try and promise I'll do something better next week. See you then.